Netflix's latest spine-chilling offering, The Fall of the House of Usher. This enigmatic series, crafted by the brilliant mind of Mike Flanagan, is a tale of wealth, power, and the terrifying consequences that come with it. Today, we explore just how scary this show really is. At first glance, The Fall of the House of Usher might seem like your typical horror series, with its eerie atmosphere and mysterious deaths haunting the Usher family. Yet, the true horror of this show lies not in supernatural apparitions, but in the depths of human nature and the consequences of one's actions. The scares here are subtle, creeping up on you when you least expect it, much like the jump scares that this series so masterfully employs. The jump scares in The Fall of the House of Usher are expertly crafted, catching viewers off guard and leaving them breathless. What makes them truly terrifying is the show's ability to create an atmosphere of security before shattering it in an instant. Unlike other horror series, these scares don't rely on supernatural elements but on the unpredictability of human behavior, making them all the more unsettling. However, for those expecting a supernatural extravaganza akin to The Haunting of Hill House or The Haunting of Bly Manor, you might find The Fall of the House of Usher to be a departure from the norm. This series delves into the darkness within the human soul, exploring the Usher family's corrupt pharmaceutical empire and their selfish choices. The ghosts here are not spectral entities but the haunting consequences of greed and moral decay. Where this series truly excels is in its poetic storytelling. Each episode is a carefully woven tapestry of tragedy and despair, drawing viewers into a narrative that is as beautiful as it is terrifying. While the gore factor is undeniably high, with gruesome deaths depicted in graphic detail, the true horror lies in the inevitability of the Usher family's downfall. It's not just scary. It's tragically heartbreaking. So, how scary is the fall of the House of Usher? It's a question that might not have a straightforward answer. If you're a fan of jump scares that leave you questioning the very nature of humanity, this series will undoubtedly send shivers down your spine. But if you're looking for traditional supernatural horror, you might find this story to be a different kind of chilling experience. As we wrap up, I encourage you to give this series a chance, especially if you appreciate horror that goes beyond the surface-level scares. The Fall of the House of Usher invites you to explore the darkest corners of the human psyche, where the true horrors often lie. All episodes are now available for streaming on Netflix, so brace yourselves and prepare for a journey into the depths of fear and despair. Thank you for joining us today. If you enjoyed this deep dive, don't forget to hit the like button, share this video with your fellow horror enthusiasts, and subscribe to our channel for more in-depth analyses of your favorite shows and movies. Stay tuned, stay scared, and until next time, embrace the darkness.